What inspires you to come to the film festival every year? You obviously have had a lot of success. What, what inspires you to continue to keep coming to see in the new films? Well, one of the things that I am is a teacher and a creator helping people to be able to create their careers. And one of the ways to do it is to become a filmmaker. The, today, we can't depend on just being an actor anymore. You have to be multi-talented with slashes. So this is the new wave of artists, and these are the people that's going to be telling our stories into the next millennium. And so therefore, I want to come and see what they're talking, see what they're doing, see what their voice is, and then hopefully encourage other people that can, to do the same thing. Do you feel that there's more opportunities for African-American actors and filmmakers now than there was when you first started in your career? Uh, exponentially. You know, the iPhone is the new camera. Everyone can make a movie and everyone has a story to tell, whereas before we had to depend on other people. Now it's about us being able to, to be creative enough and hopefully gain enough of a skill set so that we can, you know, be able to tell our stories and not depend on Hollywood. Hollywood is plan B. <laughs> Could you give us your name, your film, and you're watching Black Hollywood Live? My name is Richard Lawson. The film that I was in, or the oh, I'm I'm actually working on a very cool thing that I can't even talk about right now. Top it's top secret. Okay, we'll, just say, we'll give your name, and you're watching Black Hollywood Live. Uh, just give your name, and you're you're watching Black Hollywood Live. My name is Richard Lawson, and you're watching Black Hollywood Live.